Here's a little undercar video of the 66 Ford F100. This is an old unrestored truck. It's uh, definitely a little grungy underneath. It does have a few little rust areas. But like the typical areas, the radiator support is not as bad as a lot of these old trucks. This has some rust holes up in here. That's just a hole hole. That's not rust hole. And a lot of it is just grunge, but there is a little rust hole right up through here. If we look at the floor pans, a lot of it's pretty solid. Most of it's pretty solid. It does have a, right in this corner, the floor pan does have some rust through it. And same as this cab support, it is rusted out. Those are easily available as replacements and really not that hard to put on if you're going to be doing some rebuilding. I got to admit, both cab corners have rust. You know, the bed floor itself is mostly solid. All of this is pretty good. It does have a saddle tank over on this side of the uh, truck. Uh, it says here it's a uh, saddle tanks for pickups, 14 gauge steel. Uh, as far as I know it works, I have never put gas in it. It's awkward to put gas in. The filler pipe, as you can see, is up underneath the fender well. It does have a, there is a gas cap inside that tin can. It's kind of odd looking, but that's the way it, I got it. And that's where I've had it. Back here, there's a little surface rust. Admittedly, the tailpipe could, is towards the end of its life. I would if I was keeping the truck. I always wanted to put duels on it, but since this was my shop truck, all I did have done really, besides oil changes and maintenance, is uh, drive it. It's been a reliable truck for me for three years now. It's been my shop truck for my restoration shop where I restore vintage campers. It's made many trips to the local lumber yard, all home plywood and lumber and all that. Anyway, there's just a quick little overview. If anybody has any questions on anything or want better pictures, just let me know and we'll see if we can accommodate you. Thanks for watching.